What's happening, good people? If you haven't watched our long form video of blacking out this T's guitar, then, um, and you only wanted to see about the tuners, well then that's perfect because that's what we're gonna do. We're taking the dopamine tuners and we're gonna throw them on these, this T's guitar, which I kind of feel bad doing because the you know, locking tuners on here were good already, but we're gonna use them on another guitar, but it's pretty cool that um, Geiger had sent these out to uh, put them on and get this thing all blacked out. So let's get this thing on the bench and see how it goes. Okay. Let's unbox those tuners. All right, so the first thing we do is get the strings off. Next up is personal preference, whether you like to do the nuts or the screws first. I like to do the screws first, and I'll show you why in a little bit. Make sure we don't lose any parts because we'll definitely be reusing these really good tuners. This is good too if you have a staggered set and you want to keep them in the same order. So when putting these in, you want to actually put them in this way first. On previous ones, I've had ones where they've um, matched up perfectly, so it was just fine. If you've seen in the last Geiger tuners, they actually line up perfectly. These ones I checked just um, um, off screen before, and they're going to need a little drilling. So what I like to do is get these on somewhat tight but enough that they can move. A little bit. And tight enough that it holds pressure and it's not going to wobble around. But not tight enough that you can't adjust with a straight edge. Looks like the first two probably go in okay. to get them started with that smaller screwdriver.
What's nice too is that the new screws are actually a little bit longer. I don't know if I can line that up good, but so it'll catch, catch a little bit more of the wood itself. It looks like the last one up there will be fine. This one will have to fill in a little bit and you could either get like some wood, like fine wood from, uh, you know, sanding and a little super glue, fill it in. I've heard people using even toothpicks to do that. And then the other two actually aren't even in the same area as the hole. So we'll drill it and uh, yeah, so we'll do that. Just tighten these up now. And there we go. Well, check out those dopamine tuners. These things are slick, coupled with the knobs. If you didn't see that video, you should check that out. They really do a make a nice attention to uh, the, uh, the detail of the guitar itself. It looks so much better. Not that it didn't look bad before, but it really looks cool, all blacked out. So we're gonna let it sit for a little bit and then we'll string it up and check check all the intonation, make sure it's all good. But man's thing is pretty awesome now. You've all been a fantastic audience. As always, stay tuned.